Arkansas State football concluded spring practice with an intra squad matchup Saturday. Another edition of the pack day spring game. The Red Wolves continue to build in Butch Jones's third season in charge. First quarter, Jaquez Cross totes it for the touchdown. Black takes a 7-0 lead. Red responds. Jalen Rayner play action finds Cameron Harris for the score. We're tied at 7 after 1. In the second, Jackson Daly launches one. Jeff Foreman makes the great grab. He's not done. Switches directions and then some, and he's going to get in for the touchdown. Black team up 14-7. to seven. Later, Rayner on the read option. He'll find the end zone. We're tied at 14 apiece. The Red squad runs the two-minute drill. Rayner to CJ Cage to move the chains. Final seconds of the half, Aiden Ellison field goal good. Red led 17-14 at intermission. Defense making highlights in the second half. Sammy Johnson high points it for a black interception. Corey Rucker eligible to play this fall. Daly finds seven for a nice connection. First down and more, but no points on the drive. Cruz Temple jumps the route for a red interception, and he's going to return it all the way to the red zone. Ellison extends the lead with the field goal. Red up 20 to 14 after three. Fourth quarter, Will Pritchard up top. Foreman makes the nice grab for a first down. A few plays later, Pritchard to Foreman again for the touchdown. Black squad up 21 to 20. Dominic Zavada extends the black lead with the field goal. It's 24-20. How about the running game? Cross with a big run to flip the field later for a black first down. Red team trying to stay in it, but Sam Graham ices it with an interception. The black team wins the Pack Day spring game 34-20. We had a clean game the first half, and that's what you want as a coach. You don't want too many balls on the ground. Um, but then in the second half, we threw five interceptions. And those are things that you're not going to win games turning the football over. So those are all great teach points. I think they've maintained a great attitude throughout the course of spring. But we have to have the best summer we've ever had. Uh, we're not game ready. Definitely some upside, um, you know, and there's a couple uh, sloppy patches at times, you know, as an offense as a whole. The black squad put some points on the board, um, which was uh, really good to see. And then, you know, seeing the red team doing the same thing, we're pleased but not satisfied. It definitely goes back to the consistency piece of it and having some depth. You can't just have 11 guys that can do it. And I think that's one thing that we were, really show, were able to show a little bit today because you've seen the, you know, the black group was able to, the defense was able to play well today. So, you know, that shows that we have some depth, and I think that's going to be crucial going into the fall. We're exactly 20 Saturdays away from the Arkansas State football season opener. The Red Wolves play at Oklahoma on September 2nd. The prelude is the transfer portal window, summer workouts, Sunbelt Media Days, and fall camp. We'll track the pack right here on KAIT. At Centennial Bank Stadium, Chris Hodgson, Region 8 Sports.